Hello everyone, it's Living Online here for Server Pro and today I'll be showing you how to download and set up the Necessities plugin on your server. The Necessities plugin adds necessities into your game such as weight fluctuation and bladder functions. When you eat a piece of food, you'll see that in chat it says your weight has increased. The amount will vary based on what you ate. Over time, the more weight you have, the slower you'll go as well. A way to remove that weight is by walking around in your world. That'll take the weight away. To see your weight, you can always do slash weight. Moving on, when you drink potions, your bladder will fill up with a certain amount of fluid. When your bladder fills up, you can no longer drink more potions as you'll have to use the bathroom by typing in slash use bathroom. To use this command, you'll have to be on top of the block set to be the bathroom block in the config. By default it's a cauldron so you can simply stand on top of a cauldron to empty your bladder. This plugin is pretty simple, it adds those fun functions but it also allows you to make a lot of configurations on how much weight each food gives you and much more. To check how to change those configurations make sure to refer to the timestamps in the description. In order to set the plugin up on your server, you'll have to download it, which you can do by heading to this page. The link to it will be in the description. When you're there, all you have to do is click on the download now button on the right and that will automatically download the .jar file. When it's done downloading, we recommend dragging it to your desktop so it's easier to follow the next few steps. To set up the plugin on your server, you'll have to head to the server.pro website. When you're there, head into your server's control panel. At the server dashboard, make sure that your server's type is set to paper and that the version is compatible with the plugin version. You can find what version the plugin supports on the plugin page. Before proceeding, make sure the server is offline and then you can head to the files tab. There you'll see a plugins folder. Double click that folder and open it up. Once it's open, all you have to do is drag in the plugin file you downloaded earlier. It'll take a millisecond to upload, so when that's done, you can turn your server on. In the meantime, you can head to the console, there you'll know that the plugin is set up on the server correctly when it says enabling necessities. Note that if your server is still online when installing the plugin, please restart your server fully to enable the plugin. Don't do slash reload as this can cause errors. To make sure everything is working as intended in game, you want to head to your dashboard and copy the host name. Afterwards, start up your Minecraft application and when the game is open, head to the multiplayer section. Click add server and in the server address section, paste the host name. When that's done, double click to enter the server and after the server's finished loading up, you can test out the plugin. As you can see, if I type in slash necessities in the chat, you can see the commands from this plugin. If the same happens for you, that means you've set up the plugin correctly. However, if that doesn't happen, it may mean that you missed a step in the tutorial, so make sure to go back and refollow them. There are some optional configurations you can make with the Necessities plugin. To head into the config file, make sure to open the file section of your server. Head into the plugins folder and then into the Necessities folder. The config text file is what you want to click on. At the top of this config, you'll see all the food items registered to add weight. You can add more items here by typing them in or you can edit their values. If I change the values of potatoes to 60, it'll give me plus 60 weight when I consume potatoes. Alternatively, you can make certain foods not add any weight by changing the values to zero. Further down, you can also edit how much is added onto your bladder when you consume potions. To lose weight, you'll need to walk blocks in game. In the config, you can edit how much weight is lost every time you walk a certain amount of blocks. For example, if I changed walk blocks to 6 and weight removed to 10, every time I walk 6 blocks, I'll lose 10 points of weight. Then under bathroom used, you can alter the bathroom block used. It's set up to be the cauldron, but you can change it to anything else you want here, along with enabling automatic use and how long it takes to empty the bladder fully. Lastly, at the bottom of this page, you can edit the different messages given when you enter plugin commands. Remember though, if you make any changes to the config, don't forget to press save and restart the server to ensure the changes take effect. Well, that's it for this video. If you have any questions, make sure to leave them down below. And if you enjoyed this video, subscribe to see more from our channel. Thank you for watching.